That's so sick. Oh, 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 hold on, hold on, bro. Oh yeah, that's exactly what it is right there. Dinner, son. That is freaking crazy. Guys, a little random content moment here. National Geographic, we are following a poisonous stingray. Gotta be careful for any of the stingrays that I was chasing. Earlier, oh. Joey Slam. Rod, please. No, no, no. Please, no. Rod, please. Please, Rod. Perfect. We made it. Come on. Right here. So that's my dad. He's the dad on the trip. These are my guys. He's awesome. This is Mateus. He's like my twin. I'm loud and annoying. <laughs> These are more guides. There's Rod, the guy who does the monster fish stuff with. His best friend, Junior, and Marcel owns like a whole coffee plant for Brazil. And we're out here. This is ridiculous. But believe it or not, there's nothing here six months out of the year but water. Now all the big fish have moved in and they're trapped. That's exactly why we're taking the time to walk our way through this. Guys, a little random content moment here. National Geographic, we are following a poisonous stingray. Rod would be in the water if he didn't have these, uh, these other boots. This is so cool. How you doing, bro? Yeah, oh my God, dude. We gotta figure something out for you. We gotta give the guy a hand. They're just dragging this stuff, dude. Love my boys. We gotta go this way. Gotta be careful for any of the stingrays that I was chasing. Earlier, oh! Look at the little red tail. Come back. Yeah, he's small. Come back. No, he's hiding under the driftwood right there. Right under there. You see him? Scare him out. Do it, June. Please. There's his face. Red tail. How cool would it be to just catch him, you know, like... Noodling? Yeah. <laughs> right? It would be dope. So much fun. That thing is trapped right there, dude. Wolfish. Imagine if you put your foot in there, bro. You'll lose a toe. You'll lose your toe if you went in there. Let's try. Wait, wait, hold no. on. Let's wait for Rod <laughs> so we can watch Rod. Rod, wolfish. Let's take a moment here, guys. Admire nature at its finest. These are a beautiful set of butterflies right here. Greens, the yellows. Stuff you see on National Geographic right now. Look at this. Oh my gosh, they're so pretty. Oh, <laughs> this is so crazy. Oh my gosh. So we're, we're pretty much eating what we caught. Now, honestly, we didn't catch any of these fish besides Rod's Oscar, but take a moment. A little fire here, catch and cook. Sick. Peacock bass split in two different type of peacock bass not to menaces of course because that is their main source of income believe it or not or amazing trips like just like this and i believe their butterfly it seems like their butterfly peacock bass and an arena based on the patterns yep arena based on the patterns right there that's what they got arena and a butterfly peacock bass right there guys that is one way to go ahead and refuel to get back out there we should, what we should do, probably in the future, since we're going to be fishing like this the entire time, I'm thinking um, I go ahead and film us actually catching some of this fish and cooking it ourselves and doing stuff like that. I mean, there's no season. There's nothing. This is just as indigenous as possible, believe it or not. Look at that. Oh, yeah. That's exactly what it is right there. Dinner, son. That is freaking crazy. Wow. How cool. But Slayers, go ahead and comment below what you think about this trip so far. I mean, this is, is crazy. I mean, not a lot of people are down for this. I know for a fact that my boy Challenge Wildlife, Blake's Exotic Emirates. I think Blake, Blake, we might have actually run into Blake. Blake's in Peru, but in the Amazon himself. I'm having an absolute blast out here. Look, it's not even that bad. I'm out here thinking it's gonna be pretty rough. This is not, this is not bad. This is actually paradise, especially if you're, if you're into stuff like this right here. The wildlife type of life just camping you're just camping having fun with good people everyone wants to see you win and catch some monster fish what you doing junior oh my gosh <laughs> he doesn't have any bait he has no bait yeah yeah it's just a sabiki we're right here chilling the guys are preparing food after a good slay and we're just trying to catch some live bait right now hand lining it's crazy out here in the amazon 
fazer não, pô. Você faz as bichas tudo aqui, ó. É, pega um fubazinho pra ele. Just drops it down. It's just so big. Just like if you do it. Oh, there you go. See? That's exactly what they're eating, bro. Já tô olhando meu braço de cima aqui, ó. Muito bom demais. Me siga. Você é isca viva? É. Live bait. This thing has teeth, bro. Aqui, ó. Você? Come in, pessoal. Live bait. Look at that. Aí eles aí, ó. Tenor. Oh! Almost. Almost. That's right. Mm -hmm. He said almost means like dinner. Oh, uh, lunch. Dinner. No, I said almost because I almost dropped my phone in the water. <laughs> <laughs> See what you got, Junior? With the little knot here, we got so much stuff. So they don't have a cast net? No. Sad day. Yeah. Hey, let's see it up here, Junior. There it is! Come in, yep. So what you do, you put a peacock yeah. carcass right down there. Uh, what kind of peacock was that? Renico or Reno? Or a butterfly? This doesn't look like to me. There it is! Oh! <laughs> so what they're doing right here is catching some live bait for our next trip. They actually have the carcass of a peacock bass that they're cutting up, getting a little pieces from the inner bones. The skeleton, that's what you're doing, right? You're grabbing some meat from the skeleton? Right. And they're just trying to get some live bait around there. You can kind of see the fish. You can kind of see them. And what they do is they catch it and they put it in a chum bag believe it or not and they put the chum bag in the water so it's like since it's constant flowing water you don't need actually need a bubbler or anything like that just put the bag right inside the well put the bag right right inside the river and you're good to go look at them there's so many there it is just like that <laughs> no <laughs> yeah they're using a stick and a saviki rod right there you guys saw it earlier but the stick actually worked out in their favor dude he caught that by handy noodles look at this <laughs> That's so sick. Oh, 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 hold on, hold on, bro. No shame. Now you want Polly. Look at that. Look how red they are, though. It's the acidic water that makes them look red. Oh! There you go. He's right here. He's going through his legs. Oh, he caught it again. This guy's amazing. It's like a little pet. That's so crazy. That's awesome. Wow. Wow. Wow, that's bye, so cool. Bye, See you later, buddy. Right into the flow. That's awesome. <laughs> right here, bro.